Hi, I'm Claire Sheeran. I played Jen in the original short version of Lost at Christmas, which was titled Perfect Strangers. That was 2014, 2014 that we did that. So the journey of this, the, the short film originally, uh, it was shoestring budget. We were we were basically waiting for the weather to be right so that we can pick and pick a day to go out and just uh, get the capture the beauty of the landscape of Glencoe in Scotland. Originally, funnily enough, I wasn't cast as Jen. I wasn't cast in the short at all. No, I was literally a last ditch attempt. It's like, oh wait a minute, Claire, Claire's got some acting. Oh, I'll ask Claire. <laughs> So I was not, I was definitely not the first choice <laughs> for Jen, but it turned out pretty well. I had a blast doing it. We all had a blast doing it. It was, it was super fun, but initially we didn't have an idea of just how big it was going to uh, blow up to be. This, this, this wee 26, 27 minute short film that we'd made, um, <laughs> with no money and basically I was roped in at the last minute. I hadn't really acted in a while and haven't since. <laughs> so all of a sudden it was getting nominated, getting awarded, award like awards that I'd never even heard of. The film ended up getting into getting accepted into Cannes, which was the first moment that we realized, wait a minute, this is this is something more than what we expected it to be but the most exciting and mind-blowing thing that happened was the new talent awards in the uh, for Scottish BAFTA. I gave myself a certain amount of time to see if my career would um, go somewhere and I would at least get representation and at the end of that time if nothing had happened I would go okay I gave it a go, didn't happen, and that's okay. It's not me, it's the industry. <laughs> Basically, these these roles, um, romantic lead roles, they're reserved for the up and coming, up and coming Jennifer Lawrences of the world. Like which, myself and Natalie, we are we are proud to say we are not. <laughs> I, I I mean, for me. When the short film was made, all of a sudden I was a romantic lead in a short Christmas film, which would never have happened in a million years. And now, six years later, we're we're doing it again, and playing the romantic leads is someone who would who would not usually be in that role. And I am so proud. I, I am so proud to have ever been a part of it and to see it grow, and to and to have someone like-minded like myself, like Natalie, to be in that role again. I'm so proud. Natalie had the challenge of making that her character and that was what the feature film needed. It needed to grow. It needed to introduce a different character that was completely turned on its head from the, from the original because if it was just the same, it would be boring and I, I didn't miss out on uh, on this film at all. I'm still part of it and I'm still in it. Um, little cameo, little Easter egg. And I was kind of channeling my inner Karen Dunbar. <laughs> Lost at Christmas, it's out now. It's on Apple, it's on Amazon, it's on your Moz telly, it's in cinemas. Go get it watched, wear your mask. I'll get this thing at my face. <laughs>